Hello and welcome. Thank you for joining me. I'm Spider47, and today we're back with England. We are at war with Grenada. We're helping the Castilians out. We're going to finish the Reconquista. We're going to take our fleet, and we're going to send them down here. We're also going to go ahead and start improving relations with the Castilians. We need them as friendly as possible, and we're going to pull the Austrian diplomat back. A few wars have finished. Teutonic Order will cede Neumark. Oh, nice. A few provinces to Poland, that's fine. We're going to have to go in and change a notification here shortly. Let's come up here. There we go, and we're going to go ahead and split out some units. Uh... I want you all over here. Except for what? Six infantry and two cav. It's 12 and six. You are going to march up here. And no, you do not need a leader. You want the leader on this army. There we go. We're going to take the opportunity, since we have nothing better to do, to go ahead and declare on our neighbors. They have just finished their war, so they're going to be a little weak. Let's group you together. And we want this to pop up and pause. There we go. You come up here as well. I think we may just send you over here instead. Should be able to afford it. Should be able to hold enough of the men. Alright, where is our trade fleet? We're going to come down here for just a second. Yes, people are improving relations with us. We're at 75 with the Pope, so that'll work out nicely. Alright, let's attach you again. Scotland, yes, you still have your mothballed fort. I want to try and pounce on that real quick. Should be able to make it. Wait a few more days. So you arrived, you can sit there, you are there as well. Alright, so we can't declare on them because that will call France in, but if we declare on you, we've got plenty of CBs, uh, what's the war goal going to be? I don't think it really matters. We'll say that one. No one's going to join us, that's fine. You don't want to use part of the... Uh, Offensive wars. You can only call in your allies once every 10 years into an offensive war. Alright, so Scotland did join. And this fort is still mothballed. That's fine. And I don't particularly want... Here, come on down. And they're not actually going to turn this fort on, so it'll count as a 30-day siege. Not going to need any extra troops. And you're going to siege me? That works perfectly. Be there on the 8th. Norway broke their alliance. That's fine. Oh, Novgorod got called in. Alright. Will you not be busy with uh, Muscovy for a while? So there's six... Muscovy and Denmark entered an alliance. It's nice to know. And Leinster, they are now... Okay. So we are now at war with everyone over here. And this is what I love to see. So we're going to march in over here. You can take your time and siege what you need. We are going to detach. Do we want to do that? We don't all need to be here. I'm going to send you over here. And our navy is under attack. Alright, well, maybe you thought you were going to win that? I don't know. So there's one battle taken care of. We're going to sit and siege this province. Should finish up pretty quickly. A few extra units, that's fine. A 
We're going to take a little bit of attrition, that's fine. These are the mercenary units, we want them sieging this fort. Right, so there's that taken care of. This is going to be highlands and a river crossing. Don't necessarily want to do that. Take you. There. Stop. Come on. You come over here. You're going to come in here. And they are going where? Stop. You still want to come? You do. Alright, so we're going to get there on the 25th of November. They'll be there on the 18th of November. Detach a small stack and we're going to come this way. We have finished sieging this, so we're going to punch all of them in there. And there we go. Now... Are you still going to come? Get it for this province. There we go. So you're stuck now. You can't go anywhere. There we go. We are the defenders. They have no leader there. That's fine. They're going to head south. Alright. We don't need to send everybody over there anymore. Let's let a day take over. We shall take these two units, send them up here. We'll take one unit, send them here. Just this group together. Can march here. We'll march right on in here. Where are you coming? Support for the Lancasters. Local support for the Lancaster in the War of Roses keeps growing among the people, peasants, and nobles alike. Rally to our banner. All right, so Calais is going to support us. And we still don't have an heir, so unfortunately we're going to have to wait. Uh, do I want to take this fight? Not particularly. And we're not taking attrition here. All right, so you're going to leave. Alright, so that's finished. We're going to march you south. If you want to sit on that province, that's fine. Should just be able to take these two units. There we go. And then we'll let them sit there. Do we want to march over here now? We can't yet because we don't have that fort. That's right. Now, I'm aware that we have a military tech. I'm holding that for potential rebels that will no doubtedly spawn. So what do we have here? We've got a minor blockade that is nothing but light ships. Should we send our fleet south? These are the heavies right here. You can always try. All right. Now, we definitely don't want them to finish this siege. But I don't think we're going to be able to catch them. Where are they going? Come over here. And we'll see if they can spot us the entire time. Yeah, we're going to have to march in here. So we have finished sieging this province as well, so come on over here. Where are you all headed? Quite a ways away. And then whether they siege this down or not isn't going to be an issue. Alright. We are going to take the fight here. And... Hmm, there we go. We're going to have a river crossing. He has no maneuver, we have maneuver, so we shouldn't take a river crossing penalty. Managed to get this back as well, so we'll march you in over here. We go, our navy has returned to the Irish Sea. There goes the Scottish army, so we shall now march back. Hopefully take less attrition. 
we go. 16. Fantastic. And we'll march you over here as well. So now we're going to wait for this to finish sieging. We're going to take too many, too much attrition, too many attrition. And this is all fully reinforced art. We can make our ruler into a general. He does have one siege, so that might be worth putting over here. Let's go ahead and... out. We have a CB expiring. Provence, deploy insult, that's fine. Uh, Rebel uprising, what's gonna happen? Alright, so in five and a half years, eight years, eight years, three years. So the Bogomist. Bogomil. Bogomilist. Fine. We'll deal with them when they become a problem. Am I taking nutrition here? We still can't march over there until this sieges. This is ultimately the war goal. We want Scotland vassalized. Novgorod, are you sending anything over here? We do have four heavies. Two from Scotland and two from Novgorod. All right. Well, when they decide to come over here, we'll deal with them. We only have, what, two more months, three more months with the Pope. So they'll work out fantastically. Uh, do we want to be nice with you? Not really. Let us go ahead and give the Austrians... to ask for military access. I'll give us a boost. Who else do we have military access from? Castile. We don't want it from Portugal. The walls are broken. That works out great. There's a siege over here. Scotland, you want peace? We would too. So we have lost Neath, that's fine. Um, no. That's, that's not a good peace offer, Scotland. I'll give you an alternative. You will become an English vessel. No, you don't want it? Gives us 29, so Connacht will be upset, so will Leinster, Norway will as well. Nobody that really matters. And let's see. They're not going to be able to march over here, so let's go ahead and send them back out to protect trade. Continue making some money. They get caught, they get caught. Yeah, they're going to sail away. Minus 21%. Shortage of supply. It's effect status. The siege declaration for the York pretenders. All right, so let's see. Construct a grand fleet. We don't want to do that. Have 20 heavy ships. Yeah, no. Too early for that. Accumulate money. Well, what do we have to get up to? 278? Nope. I don't like any of those missions. Um, Puerto, you get 10 unrest. That's unfortunate. And let's see. Coming down here. I don't think we're actually going to be able to catch them. Oh, we did. How unfortunate for the Scottish Navy. I was hoping that wouldn't happen. So there's one ship left in here. There we go. We still didn't catch any. We're going to repair. And Novgorod isn't doing anything. Are you all busy? No, you're not. That's must be. Well, good luck with that. Scotland's not going to be of much help to you in just a minute. 7-0... Let's get another high roll. How's our war going down here? Uh, and declaration for the orc pretenders. 
The nobility of one of our provinces has long been divided over the War of the Roses, and now there are further nobles proclaiming for the House of York. So the province that our that our ruler comes from, Lancashire, is now going to declare for the House of York. Ironic. Uh, go away. We don't want that. Where are we? English pretenders. So you're going to happen in two years. Four and a half. Eight. Eighteen. Three. Okay. And this isn't worth spending down. Oh. Wars have become so fun in E4. All the sieging. How long has the siege been going on now? A full year. Uh, we are engaging another navy. That's fine. Should be able to handle this as well. Two to one odds. Are we going to be able to pick up any ships? No. But they do get to keep their transport, which is nice. We're at 171 Lisk Steel. We need to pull you back. We've got better things to do with you. So we're going to start improving with Austria. There we go. And then we're going to need to start improving with all of our neighbors. As well as fabricating a claim. Point nine nine, maybe. Let's hope we don't get caught. We are making one point three six. Spoils of war are full. Dug it. You know what? Actually, there's no point in spending money on a fort. It does not provide you with anything. All right, so that siege is complete. We are. Going to take almost everybody out. You stay. You march this way, you march this way. Alright, and I don't want to finish this battle. So we're going to need a diplomat. Come on back. Do you want to come in? We can maybe get some of these out. Six units. So there goes the Scottish Navy. Oh, come on. It can't be any better than that. Look, we'll even move him over here. And we'll remove the leader. No. Oh. Saints perform miracles. Some people were so devout in their religion that they set out to help the poor and heal the sick. They were often called saints for their acts and were sometimes even believed to perform miracles. We are truly blessed. We gain one free stability or we can gain 20 papal influence. Well, we'll take the stability. Definitely need that. Now, if only we could get an heir, this War of the Roses would be over. No. No, you don't want to come over here. You are military tech four. All right. Let's see, you will arrive on the 9th of March. So we're going to wait until they are movement locked. Come on. Really? Now you want to come back? Get out of here. <laughs> Great timing there. Go sit right here. You come here. Sue for peace. I wonder, can we make this peace deal with you? We want them as an English vassal. This is actually... So here, Scotland takes 51. France, Provence, Nevres. These countries might join a coalition against us. And if we make the peace deal with you...
then even Norway gets 51. I think we're going to make the peace deal with Connacht. Come on. You can make it over here. No? Fine. I guess we'll be marching in. Should put you right here. You have a one maneuver. That's fine. I'm going to bring you over here. We've got six pretender regiments, revolt, and meat. That could not have been a better place. All right. Now, you're going to want to come over here, and we have a revolt. Well, we don't have a revolt. Our poor vassal does. It's not going to be our problem. And if he's going to go in here, that should keep... What are you doing? We've engaged the enemy. What is this? What, are you fighting somebody? Oh, you're fighting Leinster. Well, that has worked out perfectly. Come on. There we go. We've rejected another peace offer. Do we need to bring the remaining army over? I don't believe so. This will take care of Leinster for a minute. As well as allow us to safely come across the Irish Sea. Our poor pretender rebels. He would have been better off just sieging our fort. Alright, so we're going to siege this up. We want to march down here. 20. We're just going to march right on over here. Um, Before we march in, though, what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and take Tech 4. In the midst of moving, we'll march in. That keeps the tactics level on par. There we go. Uh, we do have higher morale than they do. Just ever so slightly. Uh, no, we don't want a peace deal with you. And we're just going to march in here. We unfortunately do not have a leader. I don't think we're going to need one, though. There we go. There they go. We're going to follow them down. There's that stack wipe. And we really don't want to siege them. Would you like to get out of this war? No, not interested. So there's your army. Select to get out the mercenaries. No, we want our regular units to come back. All right, you stay here. Come on over here. I want one more unit. You come up here. There we go. And I guess you can sit right here. I don't think it's going to make too much of a difference. There we go. What do we need to siege this fort? There's the siege view. So we're going to need 3,000. We have the last jousting tournament. We can feel it in the wind. Soon our equestrian elite will be nothing more than a dream remembered. As the chivalrous traditions die out before the onslaught of modernity, the world is changing. But for now, for one last time, let the Knights of England ride. For the glory, we're going to lose 30 administrative power. Okay. And 56 ducats. And we'll gain morale of armies plus 10% for the next 20 years. Yearly armor tradition plus 1 and yearly prestige. Or just lose 5 prestige. Well, we'll lose the money, and we'll be set back. We did get that free stability, so we're not going to need that. English pretender rebels are still going to be plaguing us. That's fine. Select army. Group you together. Take you out. We'll send you over here as well. And then we'll start sending the armies back as we need. All right. Group you. Put you back together. Love you can come out. 
Let's go back to London. And we're going to wait until our f units cross over and then we'll do what we need. You still don't want to give us peace, do you? Um, I just want to take... I don't want Lothian. Get out of here. I just want this. Uh, Noble's disgruntled. Of course you are. We'll deal with that event in the next episode. If you like what you've seen so far, leave a like, leave a comment. As always, thank you for watching. I'll see you next time.